In this video, we are going to identify the hippocampal formation and the caudate nucleus. Here you have a dissection where I am showing you both hippocampal formations, the right and the left one. In the image, the red arrows mark the both hippocampi, the blue arrows mark the fornices, the green arrow marks the body of the fornix, and the yellow arrow marks the commissure of the fornix. As you see, both hippocampus have the shape of the horns of a ram. This is why it is called Asta Ammonis. And it forms part of the limbic system, it's the limbic cortex, as it goes around the thalamus. This is a sagittal section of the encephalon of a dog. Just to show you the hippocampal formation. The black asterisk is marking the left thalamus. The red star is marking the left coated nucleus. The yellow arrow is pointing at the parahippocampal gyrus. The blue arrow is pointing at the subiculum of the hippocampal formation. The red arrow is marking the hippocampus proper. The green arrow is pointing at the dentate gyrus. The orange arrow is pointing at the albius hippocampi. And the blue arrow is pointing at the fornix. Then we identify a mid-plane section in where the green arrow marks the dentate gyrus, the light blue arrow marks the fornix and the deep blue arrow marks the columns of the fornix. The brown arrow marks at the corpus callosum. Now we have a mid-plane section and a transverse section of the toxencephalon. The brown arrow marks the corpus callosum. The red arrow marks the caudate nucleus. The green arrow marks the dentate gyrus. The light blue arrow marks the fornix. And the deep blue arrow marks the columns of the fornix. As you see, the separation between the fornix and the corpus callosum. Now in this dissection, we have removed part of the cerebral hemisphere. To identify here, the amygdala body. The red arrow is marking the hippocampus. The blue arrow marks the cruz of the fornix. The purple arrow points the amygdala body inside the piriform lobe. Yellow arrow. Now, after removing the hippocampal formation and the cerebellum, so the blue arrows are pointing at both thalami, left and right. The green arrow is pointing at the telencephalic septum and the black arrow 
is pointing at the rostrum and genu of the corpus callosum. The red arrow is pointing at the head of the coated nucleus. The orange arrows are pointing at the body of the coated nucleus. The pink arrows are pointing at the tail of the coated nucleus. And the purple arrows are pointing at the lateral ventricles, left and right. Here we have a caudal view, where the red arrow is pointing at the left caudal colliculus of the mesencephalon. The orange arrow is pointing at the rostral colliculus of the mesencephalon. The pink arrow is pointing at the caudal opening of the mesencephalic aqueduct. And the green arrow is pointing at the commissure of the fourth cranial nerve.